Hey love bugs. So you guys have been asking me for the recipe for the hot Cheeto fried wings and here it is. I want to show you how I make it. Um, I've actually been playing with the recipe a bit. The first video I just used egg and hot Cheeto to actually coat the wings and then I fried them in my air fryer. Well this time I'm going to use mustard because everybody knows that fried chicken is better when you make it with, with mustard and we're going to see how it turns out. The only difference is I coated this with mustard instead of dipping it with eggs and I had already added the mustard and I was like oh wait I'm supposed to be recording so here we go. So first you're going to cut up your chicken wings and add in the mustard to coat it if that's the way you want to go and then you're going to need a food processor or a blender so you can go ahead and blend the Cheetos down to a powdery dust. Now before I blend the Cheetos down um, I will let you know that the Cheetos are not as spicy once you start to fry them. So if you are looking for a spicier wing, use the Flaming Hot Doritos because those things are crazy hot. They gave me heartburn and I know that they will make your wings way more spicy or your pickles, whatever you want to do. So let's get into it. Okay, so here's my little mini food processor and then you just put it together, put it together. gonna get loud guys oh you got your your bits your crumbs okay so I like to wear a glove because I don't like touching chicken I know it's weird but that's how I am so you're gonna take your crumbs and just take your piece of chicken and throw it in there and then cover that bad boy up hope it comes out good with the mustard it's either gonna be really good or not good at all but it look good to me and then um, really the the key to this guys is to just make sure that you get them fully coated so this is what they look like they're perfectly coated and now we're gonna put them in the air fryer Okay guys, so I have the air fryer all set. The wings are in there. I turned it on and I set it to air fry at 375. And then I'm gonna put it in there for 20 minutes. Um, shake your wings or flip your wings over so they don't get stuck to the place, like in the pan. Maybe after five minutes of them cooking or after 10 minutes of them cooking, but you do wanna make sure that you shake them. If you don't flip them, they're gonna get stuck and you might lose some of your breading. So we're gonna start it up. <laughs> 